Yo, what's that deal, Mace? Yes, it's another week, homies, and guess what? I got some more shit for us to talk about. And this topic right here, I can't wait to talk about because I'm pretty sure we all been through some shit like this before. Question! Have y'all ever been in a situation where y'all listen disrespectful shit slide and then get mad about the shit later? I mean, for real, whenever the disrespectful ass shit happened to you and you don't check the shit right then and there, you let the shit build up in your head and get mad about the shit later on. Just like this. <laughs> Fuck this shit! Come on, you motherfuckers! Come on! Come on, I mean, motherfucker! Now come on now, homies. Now you know damn well this shit done happened to you before. Well, if it has, then you already know. We got some more shit to talk about, so sit your ass right there and stay tuned. What's that deal, homies? I'm your boy H N K A D, coming at you straight from the West Side. What up, down? I see we got some new subscribers in the house. And for all the new people that subscribe to this channel, I personally like to say, time, <laughs> Nah, I'm just fucking with y'all. Before I appreciate each and every one of y'all out there subscribe to this channel, and I'm glad y'all rocking with me. So thanks for the love, homie. For real. And for all you new homies out there that's new to this channel, then you already know. You can't just stop by without hitting that subscribe button for your boy one time. You know what, homies? It's actually a nice ass day here in the D. The temperature's just right, and it's not too hot out here. But unfortunately, homies, you already know. I can't be out here too long. So I'm gonna stop all this talking so we can hurry up and get down to the shit. Like I said before, homies, one of the worst things in the world is when you let some disrespectful ass shit slide later on to get mad about the shit because you done put the person to check who did the shit to you. And here you are mad as hell saying to yourself, it was bitch. And the worst part about it, homies, is that you get mad about the shit later because after all that time after shit just happened, you let the situation build up to something bigger than what it already is, which leads you to get even more angrier about it, which leads you to end up doing some bullshit to yourself or somebody else who had nothing to do at all with the situation. And the reason why you let the shit slide is because of one of two things. Reason number one is because the person who did the shit is your man's, and instead of checking the answer body, you let the shit slide because you don't want to cause any beef with him. And the second and most common reason is, it was Bitch. But either way it go, homies, if some disrespectful ass shit went down, you should never wait till later to get mad about the shit, homies. Check that shit right then and there. Because if you don't, you're gonna end up like my goddamn homie. Like I said before, homies, you know that one friend who will get disrespected and won't get mad about the shit until later? That's his ass. Wanna see what I'm talking about, homies? Let's just take a look. Hey, what up, though, bro? Bro, what you think? The hell no, I ain't doing all right, man. Damn, bro. What's wrong with you? Nothing, bro. I don't want to talk about it, man. Bro, you were really sitting right there looking like you're ready to throw it all away to catch a case. Bro, before you do that, I find it'd be better to talk about the shit first. Bro, like I told your ass before, I don't want to talk about it. You sure, bro? Yeah, fool. <laughs> all right. Bro, I'm literally pissed the fuck off right now on some bullshit that happened earlier. Damn, for real? Bro, before coming by here, I literally stopped over at our boy's house, you know, to pick up that money that he owed me for earlier. Yeah. So, bro, when I went over there asking about the money, he had the audacity to act all funny towards me about it. And what's worse about it, bro, when he finally gave me the money, he didn't put it in my hand like a regular human being. He had the nerve to throw it all in my face. And after he did that, he had the nerve to turn me around, pass me, put my underwear over my head, and throw me out the door. And bro, I see why you mad now. Bro, what he did to your ass was disrespectful as fuck. So after he did all that, what you do? Man, nothing. Wait, nothing? Why not? Cause, bro, at the end of the day, he's still my man. So instead of causing any more friction, I went ahead and let it slide. <laughs> what, bro? What the hell you laughing at? Bro, you let another man disrespect you like that in front of your face, and you bitched out, bro. Man, how the hell are you gonna get mad about this shit later? Bro, for real. I'm not in the fucking mood right now, man. Oh, look at you now. Where did all this damn hostility come from, bro? Where was all this when he was out there making it rain on your ass? All right, bro, keep talking. You gonna make me roll back over and catch a case for real. Hey, chill out, bro. Don't make this shit bigger than what it already is. Bro, what I'm trying to figure out is, why the hell did you check his ass right then and know when he did this shit instead of getting mad about the shit later? Cause like I said before, man, I didn't want no problems with bro. So I went ahead and let it slide. Look, bro, I hear where you coming from, but at the end of the day, all that don't mean shit. Because if he was really your friend, he wouldn't do that shit to you, bro. So stop being a friend and start to offend by standing up for yourself and snap off on that ass. You right. You absolutely right. Thanks, bro. No problem. So you finally gonna stand up for yourself and go back over there and tell them how you really feel about the shit? Nah, you right. I'm a bitch. Fuck that shit. I'm glad I ain't got that problem no more. Bottom line is, homies, if you let some disrespect happen to you, do not wait until later to get mad about the shit. Reason why? Because you're gonna let that shit build up into something greater. And I don't care what it is. If you don't like it, say something. Because if not, it was Flat out. <sighs> Look, homies, I can keep going on and on all day about this damn subject, but I gotta get my ass up out of here, so I'm gonna go ahead and leave the story at that. So until next time, homies, I'm your boy, Adrian KD, coming straight from the west side. Peace.